Well, our 80s celebration continues. One of our favorite guests, food writer Jen Preserata, joins us now to put a twist on a TV dinner. TV dinners were pretty popular in the this 80s. Is true. They're very iconic, and I think these days we've kind of reinvented it with frozen meals. It's true. Mm. But I'm doing a fresher, healthier, and a little bit more modern twist on nice. uh, my I own like version. That. So, of course, every TV dinner, as you can see here, always has its protein. I kind of like how it's organized. Well, yeah. you know, it's not like they touch it. No, so no. Yeah. A lot of people yeah. don't like their food touching, it's you true. know? So we have our protein, our starch, and our vegetable. Got so it. what I've done here for our protein is steak, and we're going to do a steak chimichurri. So starting steak with, chimichurri. yeah, so chimichurri is almost like an Argentine pesto, if you ah. will. No nuts, but we start with flat leaf parsley. You can nice. hand chop, but since TV dinners are all about getting quick. things done quick and easy, we're going to use a food processor. Now, that was a little fresh oregano. Jen, back in the day, yes. TV dinners for you, did you have a favorite movie, favorite TV uh, show to garlic. watch? Uh, I mean, can we count as like Full House count? Full, yeah, yeah, full that's house. Yeah. That was my fan. favorite too, no doubt. Yeah, every I mean, day when I came home from school as a kid. Yeah. Yeah. Every Saved day. by the Bell was pretty good too, right? Oh, I'm really, yeah, all of it. You know the theme song? Oh yeah, you want me to rock it up? I'll do it. Do a little karaoke. I'll do a little karaoke for you. So this was so fresh parsley, fresh oregano. Again, you could use dry there's nothing like the fresh grill. So good. So Doesn't fresh. it smell Ooh. so good? Wow. And that's garlic. I mean, yeah. you don't make a lot of friends with garlic in uh, some ways, but okay. <laughs> it tastes so Girl, good. Tastes pretty darn tastes good. Tastes amazing. So we just add this to a bowl, and it's super simple. And what you can do with this is make it ahead of time and pop it in the fridge, and you can use it as a marinade for your steak. So you can start that and have it in the fridge, and when you come home, just that's throw the it on the, part. So the mm. best Half part. Half of it's done. Well, because yes. everything, again, it's we want efficiency, and we want something that's quick and also kind of affordable. So we have some olive oil we're gonna go on here. And this is just, it's so, it's so like aromatic. This is red wine vinegar, which gives it that like nice tanginess. Mm -hmm. A little sea salt, nice. nice and coarse. Crushed red pepper and a little black pepper. And then we just mix it together. I feel and like this would be good on like anything, so Jen. This is thing. It's, it's, a, it's typically done on steak. You could do it on chicken, mm -hmm. fish, tofu if you're vegetarian. Can we just you eat it really, by the spoonful? You could eat it by the spoonful. <laughs> yeah. And then here, this steak, you want to do like minute steak or you know just something something quick. Skirt Steakums. steak. Uh, sure, like the skirt steak is fast. You want something thin, not a big piece of okay. beef that has to cook through. So kosher salt and pepper. Do it on the grill outside in the summer or on a rainy day like today in your grill pan, a little olive oil. Nice. We just cooked it up like this, and then of course you'll just add it. And fresh, also make sure that when you guys are cooking like at you home, have right here. if you have hair like Adam, make sure that you're you're putting oh, it yeah, up you in a bun. Oh yeah, you want to put that back. Yeah, Teresa actually pointed that, 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 that out. Make sure, sure you got like a ponytail or yes. something For going sure. on. Sure, just like this, rock the side one. Exactly. Yeah. So moving on to our start. So these are instead of the butter laden heavy mashed potatoes, it's just not so good for you. They're delicious, um, but these are equally delicious and a little more nutritious. Uh, roasted red baby potatoes with rosemary. So totally simply rad. cut them into quarters. <laughs> we just add a little olive oil, so nice and heart healthy. Kosher salt, black pepper, again, just keep it really simple. I have some salt and pepper mixed together right here. And fresh sprigs of rosemary. Ooh. And it smells amazing. So Everybody nice. Grab a sprig. Very good. Very nice, right? Yeah, very and good. then if you want to get the kids in the kitchen, it's fun. They just pull it apart. You want to preheat your oven to about 375, and while this is quick prep, does bake a little longer. Okay. But again, you could prepare everything ahead of time and still pop it in the microwave. Nice. Um, and then for our veggie, I wanted to kind of bring it back to what you had back in the day. So these are actually frozen veggies. Looks like something from, from lunch. From 1983. Right? <laughs> like, <that's laughs> yeah, the cafeteria. Today, still full of nutrients, no additives. I did add some edamame for my 2016 modern flair. <laughs> and to spruce them up here, so you would just um, pop them in the microwave. You want to drain the liquid. This is a champagne vinegar. Um, this is actually an orange scented one. Nice and citrusy and refreshing and plays really nicely with our This is nothing wow. like the TV dinner I used no, to have. No, it's like a kid. modern twist on it. It's exactly twist. what we Where wanted. Where was Jen? A little on, olive oil, again, kosher salt, black pepper, and this is Chinese five spice one, which is amazing. It's mm. like cloves and ginger and anise and just, you know, something different. I love it's it. So. Mix it all together. And then you can sit on the couch and watch a Netflix marathon like they did back in the 80s. You can watch Full House on Netflix. <laughs> exactly. You can make a ton of money, I bet, doing this right now for that. Right, I would. I saw the one. This is my, my new commercial. I love that trade. That trade is so good. Yeah. 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 Thank it's you all so yours. much. Yeah. What a great yeah. game. We'll check out on That's, That's So Jen. That's So Jen.com. Very good. And our 80s show continues.